Michael's making elderflower for the world. Let's have a look. Look at that. Now what happens now? Now it has to stand. Two days. Two days. Yeah, 48 hours. 48 hours. you for me Rory Alec it's another vlog vlog number 20 my goodness me time is flying and do you remember this window here this little apartment where I was locked up for kind of a whole week with that awful flu well we're back in that same city that's right this vlog we are here in Klagenfurt and I'm just delighted to be with you but this time we're definitely not going to stay in this little flat we're good we're healthy we're well and we're getting out and about strawberries strawberries Look at this. It's a strawberry field. Today, I'm doing something I've never done before. I have never come to a strawberry field and picked strawberries. I don't know. I don't have you. Let me know if you have, but because I know for sure I haven't. Look at this. It's unbelievable. Hmm. I love fresh strawberries, strawberries and cream, strawberries, cream, clotted cream, scones, all wonderful stuff, scones with strawberry jam, wonderful, but strawberry jam itself is not my favorite, not my favorite, however, my beautiful girl behind me, it is her favorite jam, now we call it marmalade here in Austria, and marmalade means jam, it doesn't mean marmalade. Although I'm sure there's some cross-pollination there on the words. My favorite jam, apricots. And that's later this year. And the region that I live in, which is in the Vakao region, they are famous for their apricots. So not only on this vlog will we look at maybe making some strawberry jam, but in the future I'll show you guys how we make our apricot jam. Simple recipe, but delicious. Seriously. You can have it. Look you at this. It. Oh, that's gorgeous. Mm. Oh, yeah. fantastic. Amazing. What the Lord has created. Absolutely gorgeous. In the bottom there. You need some more sunshine. Look at this. Look at this guy. Wow. A bit of relief on there. But it's excellent. Very nice. As we call them, ananas. Really comfy. It's amazing what, how the Lord has created. That's a seed. Each one of those seeds becomes a potential strawberry bush. So you can see the Lord really has created plentiful and provision. Strawberries and strawberries and strawberries. Yeah, they are so amazing. I mean, there's... Yeah, there's no damage. Yeah, no, no. We are definitely making strawberry jam. This I can see. What do you say to that, Mrs. Stephen? <laughs> That's strawberry good. jam. I like it. A handful of goodness. This box is very much filling up. Mm. Nice. What do you say? Not at all. In Austria, picking our strawberries. Now, what's going to happen with these strawberries, you ask me, Rory? We're going to make strawberry jam, aren't we? Yeah. Strawberry jam. Jam. Look, your hands are full of the good stuff. Now they are all on your shirt. Yeah. Look at this. I spilled here, see? Yeah. We had an accident. Oops. 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 We'll get it out. Oops. Now we go over here yeah. to those dear ladies. Yeah, we pay. And we're going to pay mm -hmm. them per kilogram. Yes. And they said they're going to weigh Carola because they knew <laughs> she was going to be. They knew she was going to be eating and eating and eating. And <laughs> So they're gonna, weigh, they're gonna weigh her and see how much she has. Okay, no, okay. Careful. 
So when are you going to pick your own strawberries wherever you're watching around the world? Get out, get some fresh air. Live dangerously. <laughs> no, seriously, you know what? I literally, for 20 years of my life, ran around. My family sacrificed. I sacrificed. Physically draining. Doing it for the ministry. And I don't regret that. But I thank God that I'm in a season of my life right now where I have some rest and I'm not under the immense stress that I was because really Rory Alex's life was extremely stressful. You imagine trying to find three and a half million dollars every month. This is not easy. And of course it's by faith. Of course the Lord moves upon his people and the people support ministry. But I want to tell you as somebody who headed up a ministry for 20 years, the extraordinary stress and strain that ministers of the gospel go through to find the resources, to find the finance to preach the gospel. And so I encourage you, if you haven't tithed or if you've not given a gift to a ministry that really has touched you or your local church, get involved and give of your finance. I know you're working hard. I know you. some of you are struggling and, and, and are challenged with your own environments, but sow a seed into someone else's ministry. You know, they say, Rory, what happened to you? Maybe I got a little burnt out. I don't know. I don't think I did, but 20 years of trying to find three and a half million dollars on average every single month to run a ministry, this is no fun. But now we've got strawberries and we're going to make jam and we're going to go out here and pay for them now. You got some good strawberries. I love it. Carola's love. son Alex loves strawberries. Come it's on, let's put him. Here we go. Oh, what that means? What a harvest. <laughs> oh. Come on, my darling. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, not for the jam. No. These we're going to have with ice cream, right? Yes. Right. <laughs> but these guys... These are going to be cooked. ...have been topped, not tailed. Mm -hmm. And we're now going to rinse them, make sure that they're nice and clean. No chokhdi Yeah. No unfriendlies. It's Freshly so picked from yeah. the fields. Yeah. And now we're going to make jams. Watch the steps now. So... We rinse first. first. <clears throat> yeah, we rinse them, then we cut them a little bit. We're also going to use that. To go a little bit. Okay, so we'll cut that up. A little bit, so that it's a little bit juicy, a little bit uh, pieces. All I can see is the Lord's blessing here. Yeah. Because every single one of these little yellow mm. seeds create new, create new strawberry plants with these little seeds. Take them off, dry them, pop them in your garden, you'll have a never ending supply mm -hmm. of strawberries. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're ready. We look like we're in so, the business here too. One, no. two. Bubbles. So once it starts to bubble, you put on the timer for four minutes. Yeah. Then you bottle your jam. Yeah. And out of this amount of fruit, one kilogram of fruit, how many four. bottles of four? Four. We're gonna get four of yeah. these. It's not a very complicated process. Yeah. You rinse your fruit after topping off them. First take the green top off the strawberries, then you rinse them. You then cut them into the pots. 
Blend them slightly. Add sugar, the right amount. Put the pot on the stove. Get it up to boil. Let it boil for four minutes. While it's warming up here, you can hear my beloved wife flashing everything here. You get the pot is ready. A key thing in how we make our strawberry jam is we make sure we don't overcook the fruit. Because we don't want to lose too much of the nutritional value. Don't cook more, that's also a secret, not much more than one kilogram per one go because it's just getting nicer than... Be careful you don't burn a bit. Uh, see, it runs down the sides a little yeah. bit. Yeah. So, we will have to just look at that. Well done. We have one <laughs> lovely. Just think about it. This morning he woke up the strawberry happily in the field, and tonight he's been turned into something quite delicious. Girls have got hands of steel. This is one to one. This is one to one. 